What's up, y'all? It's your boy, BJ, man. We back up in the building with another video, man. Today, I want to talk to y'all about something like what be killing me. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna hold y'all up, though. Y'all know I'll never hold y'all up, man. Y'all know I'll never hold y'all up. So let's get straight into this video, man. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up, baby? We back up in the building, man. We back up in the building. I want to talk to y'all about something today like what be killing me, man. What be killing me is these no good ass daddies, fathers, baby daddies, whatever y'all want to call them motherfuckers. Excuse my language, man, but that's just how I feel about them niggas. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I never, I never understood. Like I said... I seen a lot, guys. Like just growing up, like I see a lot. I seen a lot of fathers, baby daddies, and daddies, or uh, whatever you want to call them. You know what I'm saying? That's not nothing. That don't do shit for their kids. That don't care about their kids. Like you know what I'm saying? Sitting around a crib, got the mothers working. You know what I'm saying? It should be like the other way around. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, read the Bible. <laughs> Bible will tell you. You feel me? But I just feel some type of way. Like I said, I feel some type of way. No good ass fathers, baby daddies, daddies, whatever you want to fucking call them. <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying? I just don't understand how. Some people have all these kids and they don't, the fathers don't want to step up. Y'all the ones help making these babies and stuff too. So it's just like, I don't, I'm not understanding why y'all not stepping up or y'all thinking, you know what I'm saying? Some, you got some motherfuckers, they want to go party with their friends, go drink, go smoke, go fuck another girl or something like that. Like, I never understood it. You have a, you have kids, you have a family, you know what I'm saying? So it's just basically like you just showing your kids the wrong way, basically. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like it always bothered me. It always bothered me. Like I see a lot of fathers too now today, like in today's lifetime, just not doing nothing. <laughs> Playing video games, uh, smoking, just chilling. What a mothers doing all the hard work and all the hard slaving and shit. <clears throat> I, I don't get that shit. I don't get that. Like, that's why I say I'm different. I don't get that at all. Like, what? Excuse me? Like, nigga, if you don't get up and get off your ass, put that video game down, put that blunt down, put that bottle down, stop fucking whatever you doing. Like, nigga, you supposed to be the head of the household. You feel me? Showing your kids the way. Helping your wife, helping your girlfriend, whatever. You feel me? If y'all got a family, you got to do what you got to do. You know what I'm saying? There's so many no good motherfucker fathers, baby daddy, whatever you want to call them motherfuckers. Like I keep saying, whatever you want to call them. There's so many of them no good niggas <laughs> out here. And I just don't like it, guys. That's just from my opinion and my perspective. Y'all supposed to be raising your kids. Y'all supposed to be making sure your kids got the best. The baby's father, money. Like, like what? What type of shit is this? You know what I mean? Don't get me wrong, guys. It's okay to need a little help. You know what I'm saying? But if you just just sitting around a crib, you just want some money for some weed, you playing a video game, you call your bros over, or you know what I'm saying? Y'all not doing nothing like no. And you still got a responsibility. You still got something that you supposed to be doing, but you're not doing it though. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what I'm saying. <laughs> you got something that you're supposed to be doing, you're not doing it. I see people smoking in front of their kids. Like if you don't tell your kids or you know what I'm saying, go in their room or you go outside. Don't, they ain't supposed to be around them, period. You got some people, act, some men, act like they can't work. Not bringing nothing to the table. You just got the woman. You know what I'm saying? The woman just 
taking care of the household by herself while you still laying up not doing shit. I'm not understanding. I don't get it. Oh, that shit fuck with my head. <laughs> like I say, guys, excuse my language, but it's just like, man, that stuff bothers me. Like, I'm not even playing. Like, that stuff bothers me. I don't get it. Like, why have kids and not take care of them? I don't get it. You feel me? Your kids be looking up to you. That's what people don't understand. People don't understand that their kids be looking up to them. Kids have feelings too. First of all, they didn't even ask to come into this world. <laughs> you feel me? They have feelings too, but to see that they not getting their proper leadership that they supposed to be getting, it's crazy. It's just crazy, man. It's crazy, guys. It's crazy. Like I say, I don't like them type of people. Me and them type of people don't get along. You feel me? If I see somebody that's being a bad parent, I tell the people the people that I see around in my daily life, if you being a bad parent, man, step that shit up. Your kids need you. You can't be sitting around here laying under no female. You can't be sitting around here playing no game, video games like you 10 or 12 or something, nigga. <coughs> you got to go work. You got to be working 24-7. Oh, I don't want to work. Oh, working ain't for me. How is she going to do it? Unless you find out something you love to do or something, you know what I'm saying? You get paid off of it. But how is she going to do it? They don't want them to do... The thing is, guys, people, the, these no-good-ass fathers, they don't want to do what they're supposed to do to get the job done. You put yourself in a situation, now get the job done. No excuses. No excuses. You got some kid, uh, some, some of these no good niggas. They can't even buy their kids an ice cream when an ice cream truck ride past the block. When an ice cream truck ride past the block, like, are you serious? You don't have a dollar to your name to provide for your kid? Are you fucking serious? I don't understand it. I do not understand it, guys. Like I said, guys, it always bothered me. Like I just, as I was growing up, like I already knew I was different from from the jump. I already knew I was different from the jump because I can't cope. I can't do that type of shit. I can't play them type of games. I'm not gonna play with my motherfucking kids. They gotta have everything. I'm not saying just like just get them everything, but they just gotta be taken care of, guys. Y'all know what I mean. I see some kids, parents, they don't even give them the proper the bathing, you know what I'm saying, that they're supposed to get. Kids supposed to take baths, showers, whatever, every single night, every single day. Some parents, they don't do that. They do not. I'm telling you what I've seen with my own two eyes, like... A lot of people don't do that, guys. You got some, you got, you got some parents. They feed their kids noodles, and they go get some Coney Island. Like what? Or make them a steak. What make you think your kids want to eat noodles all day, every day, nonstop, and you eating all this good shit? What makes you think that? That's just a selfish motherfucker. Just thinking about itself. Maybe you're not ready for no kids. Maybe you need to put them on somebody else or something. Or just put on your damn big boy pants and get to working. You feel me? But guys, that's... It's just like, I play things a totally different way. Like, I literally play things a totally... As soon as I have my first child, that's just gonna be like... All I know is I'm gonna love them to death. Like, I'm gonna love them to death. I don't understand how you got... Don't get me wrong, too. It's some... Parents, some single fathers out there that's doing... Taking care of their kids by themselves. I salute to y'all 100%. I 
I'm not going to knock that from y'all. Like I say, it is some fathers out there, some parents, you know what I'm saying, single men out there that's taking care of their kids. Manning up, owning up, taking a full responsibility, ownership, and getting the job done. I salute to them, 100%. 100%. We got some mothers out here, too, that just want to be on some whole shit or... Gone about their life and shit like that, etc. It's mothers out here that's bad too. You feel me? But I'm just talking about the men, guys. I'm just, I'm really just talking about the men. I just wanted to want to talk about the men. You feel me? I want to talk about the men. That's another video right there. <clears throat> but I say, guys, it's you really have to step up like y'all 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 men all the men out there that's not doing shit for y'all kids y'all really need to step up y'all need to step the fuck up hey like right now <laughs> y'all be too worried about some other shit y'all be too worried about girls you know what i'm saying parties hangouts smoking sessions new video games like what the fuck 2k19 like i don't give a fuck about that man you give a fuck about none of that? <laughs> like, y'all niggas need to get y'all hair straight. <sighs> niggas be hitting the weed. <sighs> Bro, you heard, you heard, you see the uh, 2K19 coming out I'm about the grab? Nigga, you ain't even taking care of your kids. Don't talk about no shit like that to me, nigga. You'll get your ass slapped. <laughs> I'll be dead serious, guys. I can't even make this up. That just shows you, that it shows you right there just where people brain be at. Like, a lot of people too, they just probably just had kids just to, they had them at a young age or some crazy shit. I don't know what the case may be, man. But I know, guys, I just don't, I just don't condone treat your kids like that or just not being aware of they situations where they feelings and stuff like that too and the things that they need taken care of just off the top it should be no this that you got some people some men and some parents too they just go ahead and um they, their kids need something the kids call them seven or eight times my kid only got to call me once i mean it's not saying that i'm gonna just jump for them all the time like that but it's just like you never know what the situation may be though you know what i'm saying niggas be in there smoking it smoking playing the game like they can't part the game like they can't just restart the game like what i don't get it oh i'm on round 22 i mean i'm pretty sure you can go on round 20 get to round 22 again it's not that fucking hard you feel me Oh, I'm uh, playing such and such. I mean, I'm pretty sure you can rematch such and such or tell such and such to hold on or put the game on, whatever. It's not that fucking serious. <laughs> People like these, man, these guys, these no good ass fathers, daddies, baby my baby daddies, whatever you fucking want to call these niggas, they is no good. And I don't condone that, don't that shit, nigga. Period. <laughs> Period, nigga. I don't condone that shit. Soft ass nigga. Hoe ass nigga. <laughs> <laughs> that just for me, feel me? Like I say, y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video, man. That was just a video about these no good daddies, baby daddies, fathers, whatever y'all. Like I said, whatever y'all want to call them, motherfuckers. Man, want to tell y'all how I felt about that situation, man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, man. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe, man. I will be back with more great content, man. It's your boy. Thank you all for watching Life with BJ, man. And I'm out. I'll see you all next time.